I thought we did. I thought it was one of our more complete periods, just uh, just kind of digging in, playing a team game. Uh, really proud of the guys. And, you know, against a, a team that's playing extremely well right now, they, they check hard. They've won a lot of games. Uh, they're, they're playing extremely well. So, you know, I felt we got away from our game a little bit in the second period, but uh, if we come out in the third, I give our leadership group a lot of credit. They led the charge, but uh, we got contributions up in that lineup. I thought it was a, it was just a, a, it's a great blueprint for a team game and what, what we can bring to the table. We can be a whole lot harder, harder to play against. And I thought we did it in the third, you know, they get a huge goal from G's line and, uh, I thought all four lines played well, but the guys that was that were defending the lead at the end with the full goalie OC had a couple of huge block shots. We got some saves. It was just a, it was a complete effort in the final third for sure. With Lundqvist playing the way he is, Jari coming back up soon, how difficult are these decisions for you over the next you know, couple days? They're always tough. You know, they're always tough. Um, these guys are all terrific people. They care a lot. They want to play, and uh, so that's it'll be our job to try to try to put the guy in there that's going to give us the best chance to win but we have faith in all these guys they're all they're all quality goaltenders what led to the decision to split up to say they're not going to the uh i i just didn't think we had the the momentum uh in the second period that uh that we had hoped to to get uh, i thought the first period was pretty good i thought we got away from the second period give washington credit they played well but you know, there's always going to be that decision on whether we load up that line or uh, if we put G in the middle, we have the, we have the ability to balance the group a little bit more. I think it makes the matchups a little more difficult. And as, as you can see, G's line, you know, scores in the third. So uh, I think with Rusty coming back in the lineup, it gives us a little bit, it gives us some more options to try to, to try to create that balance. And so that was, that was one of the things that we had in the back of our minds going into the game quite honestly. We were going to see how it went. And, if uh, you know, if, if we we didn't think it was going the way we wanted, that, that we knew that, that that was a that was an option we could go to. What was it about the third period that allowed you guys to hold them to what was saying five shots on goal? I just think we defended hard. You know, we were above the puck. Uh, we didn't play a high risk game. We made good decisions with the puck, and we defended as a group. And I think when we defend hard and we have that mindset, I think we can be hard to play against. You know. And uh, our challenge is going to be to bring that consistently shift in and shift out, period in and period out, game in and game out. I think if we can have that mindset, then, then you know, we're going to put ourselves in the position to win a lot of games. Mike, you talked about Carlson before the game. I imagine you're pretty pleased with how he started the today. I, I thought he had a really strong game. Uh, you know, he played extremely well. Uh, and, and he has that ability to, to make an impact the way he did. You know, early in the game, I thought he was really noticeable. Um, just with his skating, he's a one-man breakout. Um, he's so good on the offensive blue line. You know, he made some really nice plays. I don't know how many points he got. He scores. He made a, a super nice pass to uh, to Bunce on the goal. Um, that that's the impact that he, that he can have uh, with our team. And uh, I was I was really happy for him. Uh, you know that, that he had that type of game for the team. Thank you.